hello everyone and welcome back to my channel so i'm just about to get ready because um jack and i are going to the evening reception for one of the netball girls weddings um so yeah i'm gonna basically do my makeup and thought i'd have a little catch up um what am i looking for my eyebrow pencil so usually i would tint my eyebrows beforehand but I have not had time when I say I have had the busiest week like it's been ridiculous so Tuesday evening obviously this is on top of work so Tuesday evening I um had a friend round for dinner and then after we filmed an episode for my podcast if you haven't checked it out check it out um, it's called Girls World and it's available to listen to on Spotify. There is new episodes every week. Um, so we filmed an episode of that and then obviously I had to upload that. And then Wednesday after work I went straight over to... Um, there's like a city about half an hour away from where I work. It's basically half an hour away from where I live but I work half an hour away from here. So this is the city. This is where I live and this is where I work. So I went from work to the city and then obviously home, rather than go home and then up there. Um, but yeah, basically I went to the city to meet my friend Jody, and we grabbed dinner at Five Guys and then we went to watch the Barbie movie. Um, has, there, has anyone seen the Barbie movie? I feel like everyone has seen it now. I think I was like the last person to see it. But we um, booked tickets and I did not think it was still going to be this busy because at this point it's been out for like a good few weeks um, and also it was like a Wednesday evening so it wasn't even like it's um, like a weekend like a Saturday daytime or something but I just was not expecting it to be as busy um, so we got our seats and the cinema was selling pizza who knew the cinema sold pizza? Um, but yeah, I did that. And then on Thursday, I had someone over in the evening. And then I had to wash my hair and stuff and prep for tonight. Because yesterday, Friday, I was um, going out for dinner straight after with a work friend. And then a work friend? She's not a work friend. Um, I was just going out for dinner after work with a friend. And then... Um, yeah, had to do my toes when I got in and like basically give myself a pedicure. So um, yeah, I managed to gel my nails as well. So I've got this color, which is gonna match my dress, which I will show you um, later on. But I have just not stopped. <laughs> and I've barely seen Jack because the two nights that I was out for a, a while. So um, the Wednesday when I was at the cinema and the yesterday, the yesterday, yesterday, um, Jack, one of his friends has got like an area where they can camp, basically in his garden, but like it's cooler than that. Um, so he was at the camp and so obviously I don't see him then that night or the following morning. So I've just seen Jack the first time since was it yesterday morning? No, because I didn't see I feel like I didn't see him yesterday morning. I don't know. But basically i haven't seen jack very much either and then yeah tonight we are going to this wedding which i've been looking forward to we don't go to very many weddings so i'm buzzing i love a wedding oh, i should absolutely have done my eyebrows before picking up and deciding to film so i've just got back from um work and had a quick shower and now I'm trying to not reveal anything to you um trying to get my makeup done as quickly as possible but with it still looking nice yeah cool um so that we can then um the venue that the wedding is at halfway between our house and the venue one of the um other netful girls lives there and so she was like, oh, you can pop in and we're doing some drinks at ours first. Um, and that's at like half 
six I think and the wedding starts at half seven and the time now is like half five so we'll see <laughs> I've I just thought I'll try and film and have a shower wash my hair not wash my hair um take my makeup off do a fresh face of makeup and curl my hair and get dressed all in an hour if I can I'm absolutely de determined because yeah I want to hear this. and it's really annoying because I've actually been quite quiet at work for anyone who's wondering by the way I'm a beauty therapist which is why I don't want any nails and do my own treatments um but yeah I was actually quite quiet at work today so it's really annoying because obviously I've been quiet but there's so much I was like I've got so much to do but obviously I can't start getting ready and stuff at work oh dropping stuff now um, but yeah, my dress is pink and white and I panicked at first. I was like, is there too much white on my dress? Because obviously it's a wedding, but um, I showed my mum and she was like, no. And as I've thought of it, there isn't really that much white. I don't know why I was panicking so much. Um, but yeah, so that's why my nails are pink and my toenails are pink and I've got, um, some white shoes which I ordered on next day delivery from ASOS to come yesterday and they did thank the lord um so yeah I've got white shoes um I actually really like them I've gone for they're basically a I don't know how to describe it basically a platform sandal so they look like heels but they're actually not heels and I, so I'm driving as well, so I'm not, not actually going to be drinking, um, but I can't drive in, I just can't drive in many shoes. I don't know if I'm just an idiot, but um, I'm going to have to fully drive in trainers and change into these shoes when I get there. But I wanted something that I can dance in because honestly, I dance like crazy. <laughs> I think the last time I was doing Get Ready, I was going to someone's 40th party and yeah, you just thought that I was, was I going to a party or was I going to my netball social? I can't remember, but um, either way, you would think I was drunk if you saw me. It's kind of embarrassing, but it's fine, I'm happy. <laughs> um, so yeah, I do not need a drink to get in the party spirit. And I thought, should I take, oh, this is really hard doing my neck. I thought, should I take like some flip flops? flip flops or something but then I've decided against that because I just think I'm not gonna fit in my bag I'm not bloody carrying flip flops around um I don't think parking is gonna be that near because it just never is is it like it can be near but it's not gonna be like oh I'll pop to the car kind of near um so yeah that's uh, I've decided to rule that out I'm just gonna if I have to take my shoes off I have to take my shoes off you never know when they're not like shoes you've had for ages do you? you don't know if they're comfy or not but they were the comfiest ones that I tried on out of what I had and they're like how do I describe it like a woven natural sort of material on the bottom and then they're they've got like a white strap up the front and I think at the back um but yeah and then an iridescent bag because I don't have a white bag and I went to Primark um, last weekend to see if I could get a white bag and maybe some white heels. <clears throat> oh my god, it was a disaster. They had like two white bags and the one that I preferred, Jack was like, oh no, that looks so cheap. Um, and the other one I was like, you know what, I just don't like it. I was carrying it around the shop with me for ages and I thought, I am just buying this because it's a white bag and it's fitting the brief. I don't actually like it. So, um, yeah, I didn't get a bag. So then in my panicky way, I text my mum and was like, do you have a white bag? Um, and she sends me a photo of two bags. One's a pink bag. <laughs> so no, not a white bag then, mum. Um, and one is an iridescent bag, which is quite nice. So that's kind of like, I don't know how else to describe it other than like unicorn. So it's whatever colour um, it reflects against. So it'll probably look quite pink, but that's fine. Um, it's the, I, cause I also wanted a clutch bag as well. So 
just to make it a bit more difficult. Gosh, why is trying to talk and do your makeup so impossible? I'm probably gonna find that I've like missed loads of parts because I've got my makeup sat in, like my mirror, sorry, sat in a different place to usual because I thought I'll film. Also, I washed all my makeup brushes the other day, so um, you wouldn't believe it, but I did actually wash that one. Um, but they're all fresh and clean, and I haven't used some of them for so long. Like, the longest time, because I just kind of, not forget, but um, I think I just, well, I haven't used any of them since I moved in, and that was a year ago. They'd just been out, so they had actually collected a lot of dust, which is obviously grim, so I thought I'll clean them up. Because years ago I would have used all of those brushes, whereas now I wouldn't. I've got my staples, I've got my favourites that I use all the time, and that's probably not going to change, to be honest with you. Um, but yeah, I'll probably try a few different brushes today. Um, I don't know, I don't want to have loads of makeup on because it's going to be quite hot in that. Well, I imagine it's going to be quite hot because I think it's inside. And my dress is like a wrap dress and it's longer at the front and shorter at the back and it's um got like sleeves down to sort of here so i don't know if i'm gonna be too hot i've also been panicking that i'm gonna be like overdressed for just an evening do but because this is what i mean when i say i don't have many like cool events to go to because i wanted to wear this dress for ages but because it was like I was basically pretty sure it would be suitable for a wedding. Um, so then I've been panicking on my way home thinking, oh, I've, well, I've got a play suit I could put on, but then I thought it's a holiday place. It hasn't really got any pink in. So I think I am just gonna go with the original dress that I was panicking about because as someone said to me, all of the day guests are gonna be there. So if you feel like you're looking like a day guest, no one's like, you're not really sticking out, are you? So that was some good advice to be fair i'm gonna put a bit more foundation on my forehead i feel like it looks like i put loads of foundation <laughs> i kind of have but um oh God, this is what i mean in a panic I'm getting stressed i feel like sorry <laughs> trying to get um in a comfortable position without flashing everything because I've just got on like one of these because I feel like if I just had a towel wrap around me it would just just like fall off me um but yeah I'm gonna blend this all in and then I'll probably come back to you when I'm doing my hair when I've just finished my makeup and show you what that looks like because otherwise I'm just gonna waffle so I've curled my hair I haven't actually put any lipstick on yet, but this is the dress that I'm wearing. And and I will, um, this is the bag. Oh, my hair doesn't look very good now, Jack. It does seem um, This is the bag. So it's iridescence alike, depending on what you're showing. Do you wanna show your outfit, Jack? Yeah. <laughs> Jack's not actually wearing this. <laughs> Big baggy t-shirt. He just wants to wear that whilst he drive over. Oh wearing a pink shirt i'm not i'm getting there i'm keeping this orange right on. pink like me my hair is just i think it's the humidity I think it's the humidity good. and i mean i'm not gonna get my feet on camera but i'll show you my shoes in a second maybe you can take them off <laughs> these are them because i can't drive in them so i just tried them on with my outfit because i hadn't actually done that yet um, but yeah, I'm going to put trainers on to drive. <laughs> I hope no one sees me leave the house. Um, but yeah, that is what we're wearing. Um, maybe I'll insert a picture at the end of this video. I don't know. <laughs> 